Hello everyone, today we are going to take a look at two ways on how to add film simulation recipes to your RAW files. I was going through some photos from my recent trip to the north of Spain and Portugal and thinking, man, this would look so good with the Portra 800 film recipe. Of course I could have edited the photos in Lightroom, but I wanted the exact Fujifilm color science. We all love shooting JPEGs with film simulation recipes, but maybe sometimes you think other recipes will look good on the photo you took. This is a quick way you can do this in camera. If you don't know what film simulation recipes are, check out the clip at the end of this video. You can also do it on a computer, but more on that later. This is a great way to edit on the go and send the photos to your phone to share them with the world. Let's see how we can add the Portra 800 film recipe to the RAW files in camera. Press the play button and select a RAW photo. Then press the Q button. Now you will see the RAW conversion menu. Here you can change almost all settings of the photo. The one thing you cannot change is the dynamic range. If you took a photo with dynamic range 200, then you will be able to select only dynamic range 100 and 200. If you want access to all dynamic ranges, shoot at 400. Now let's introduce the settings for Portra 800. After you have entered all the settings, press the Q button and wait for the camera to process the file. Now if you are ok with how the photo looks, just press ok and the camera will store a JPEG file with all your settings. I am glad that Fujifilm added this feature on Fujifilm cameras. It is a nice tool to have that lets you experiment with different recipes on RAW files. The second thing you can do is connect your camera to a computer and use the in-camera engine with the Fujifilm X-RAW Studio to add your favorite recipes to any RAW file you want. Download and install the Fujifilm X-RAW Studio. If you didn't do that already, you can find the link in the description. Open your camera and go to the setup menu, connection settings, connection mode and select USB RAW conversion. Connect the camera to your computer and open Fujifilm X-RAW Studio. Here you will see the camera you have connected and the firmware version. Now select a folder with the RAW file shot with the camera you have connected. RAW files shot with another camera will not work. Here you can see the EXIF data of the photo including the camera settings you used. With this app you can also see the film recipes you have saved in your camera. The cool thing about this is you can change them here, which is a lot faster than doing it in camera. Here you can change all the settings you want from white balance to sharpness and clarity if your camera supports it. Just click on the option you want to change and add the settings you want. Also, you can create your own film simulation recipes and save as many as you want, not like in camera, where you are limited to 7. After you entered all the settings you want, click on convert and the app will make a JPEG file with all your settings. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, please like and subscribe. This really helps me grow my channel and make more videos for you to watch. Also, if you want to know more about film simulation recipes, check out this video here. If you want to support me even more, check out my presets pack and links in the description below. See you next time.